This town affected in Fukushima nuclear disaster will reopen to the public in April 2019. Amid heavy decontamination efforts in Okumur, Japan one of the two towns affected by the Fukushima nuclear plant disaster in 2011, city officials are planning to partially open the town back up to the public in 2019. The Fukushima Daiichi, or number one, was a plant that contained four nuclear reactors. The disaster was as yet, according to reports by cabinet office official Yohei Ajino, conditions in the area have been vastly improving in recent years you enough so that the Japanese government believes that parts of it will be safe to re-enter by April 10. Edwin Lyman, the acting director of the nuclear safety project and nuclear expert, said that decontamination efforts consist of the cleaning or removing of radioactive affected surfaces and objects in the area such as soil, buildings, forest land and agriculture land by dumping it in temporary disposal facilities. The accident dispersed a pretty large quantity of radioactive isotopes including one in particular called CS-173, Lyman said in an interview with TPG. This isotope has, as for how effective decontamination is, Lyman suggested that certain areas within the exclusion zone probably aren't going to be safe for a long, long time. You can decontaminate, despite this, theorized that the reopening of certain parts of Okumur could cause a new tourism push to the town. Some areas of the, here are some pictures that were taken in the Fukushima exclusion zone in the past eight years. People often compare the Fukushima exclusion zone to Chernobyl, which experienced its own infamous devastating nuclear disaster in 1986, although the impact there was significantly larger. Urban explorers, whether Fukushima prefecture officials plan on leaving remnants of the disaster for tourism purposes intact is currently unknown. A majority of the featured photo by Lars Nicolaysen slash picture alliance via Getty Images.